everyone welcome back to a new video in today's video i'm going to be showing you the brand new collection the indulgence collection <laughs> from nelchemy um oh my gosh there's some really really nice colors in here um, if you haven't tried nelchemy um do do it now because they've got 25 percent off um it's a black friday sale i think it's until monday i'm not sure but i'll leave the information in the description box below using code bf25 you can get 25 percent off when you order uh so i'm gonna just swatch the colors for you the first one here is called sixpence it looks predominantly silver but there are some little blue flecks in it can you see that it's really really nice they they done um, a live launch on facebook as they always do um and i've got to say they're so they they look nice on on camera but they look they're so much nicer when you get them in real life um not that they work do you know what i mean you just think wow wow like each one i swatched i was like oh i really like this one um so this is six pence what i'm gonna do is i'll do two coats of color and then I will top coat with Nelkami's non wipe top coat. So I'm only going to show you this once doing the swatches. Um, yeah, so that was sixpence. These colours are so gorgeous and rich. And I think the name of the collection really does describe the colours. The next one is Sugar Plum. This is a, another one that is in, um, it's in a clear gel. But there's so much of this like rosy pink colored glitter through it so you could use this as a you could put down a color coat and then put the like one coat of this over the top perhaps so that is sugar plum i love the name as well i love the names of some of these glitters they're really good names isn't that color just gorgeous I had to show you a bit closer because I didn't feel like I was doing it any justice. It's so pretty. Um, Champagne Fizz. This is another one in a clear gel. Um, and it's just a, a nice champagne gold coloured glitter. It's not like one of those horrible yellow gold ones. I don't really, I'm not keen on like yellow gold, you know, yellow gold gold. I like gold gold. And this one, see what I mean? It's in a, uh, it's in a clear gel. So again, you could use it as um, just to like give, give a, a bit of a glitter layer over a solid colour. Um, but there is quite a lot of glitter in these, so you would get quite a lot of glitter over the colour, I think. If I'm, I don't know, I might, be, I might be talking rubbish, but you could, I think you could do it. The next one is Blackberry Sparkle. Initially, I thought this was my favourite, but then as, um, as Hayley went through the live, oh, it just gets better. <laughs> <laughs> so this one is a uh, it's like a holographic glitter i don't know if it's just pink but it's in a purple jelly color it's but it's not a very actually it's not much of a it's 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 slightly jellied but not jelly jellied like that's two coats and that's covered quite nicely and you can see you can really see the glitter in that it's so pretty blackberry sparkle the next one is turkish delight this is one of my favorites out of the whole collection um it's a pink gel polish but you get like um it's got like a different oh, it's got like a purpley purpley bluey kind of hue to it it's just it's really pretty i don't I, maybe it's not blue maybe it's just purple i'll have a look properly in a minute second coat can you see where the light hits it it's got more of a kind of don't know but i love it whatever it is i just love it <laughs> so that is turkish delight again i love the name i don't like turkish delight myself but i just love the name the next one is mint humbug this is probably up there with my top three out of the whole collection yeah it's this one. Oh, this is so nice and this would make an amazing mermaid set as well like forget christmas hello mermaids no we can't forget christmas i love christmas see this one's got a really gorgeous 
I don't, it, it's, it's, oh, I don't even know. It's like a glittery, it's just got glittery, I don't even think it's flakes. It just, it's just so nice. Look, it's almost like an iridescent -y glitter. In fact, it might be, but I love this one. Oh, and this one is nice too. <laughs> I can't help it. I'm getting excited. Mistletoe. This is, it looked, I thought it was going to be greener. Um, but it's got like a, it's like a bluey green. Um, it's a really nice one. And again, it's got a really nice shimmer in it. It's almost like iridescent, sort of like very small flakes through it. So that is, that's mistletoe. Oh, I love that one. And then we're kind of getting on to oh, the ones that I can't decide which is my favourite. So, I've, and you know I'm not a red person. I'm not too, I'm not a red fan. But check the next, I think it might be the next three. The next three colours for Christmas nails. Oh. So this has got, this is like a, like a red jelly, but it's not a very translucent red. I don't know, it's, I don't know. Maybe I'm using the wrong word to describe it. But it's got the most beautifully bright red glitter through it. Isn't that amazing? Could you imagine? Oh, Christmas nails. It's just, it just shouts Christmas to me. And the name, Spiced Apple. Oh, ho, ho. Um, mold wine again oh, I love this one uh, there's not one that, but they do this to me now can we do this to me right they bring out look at that isn't that the most beautifully rich plum color oh look at that and again it's got one of those iridescent type flaky shimmery looks to it oh I love this color and then the top coat yeah, they do this to me. They bring out collections, and I'm like, oh, no, I like that one. Oh, no, I like that one. And you just can't pick a favourite, and you're like, I've just got to have them all. <laughs> so that one was mold Wine. That mold Wine is definitely up there with my favourites. But then there's this one, and I think this might be the last one. Look at that for a red. A Christmas red is, oh, it just, oh, Brandy Snap. I love you. Even though you're red. You are really rich, deep, Christmassy, goodness red. You are. Oh. Look at that. Oh, I love that one. So, yeah, get yourself over to Nail Kimmy's website. They've got 25% off using code BF25, but they are for professionals only. Um, I'm now going to be doing a quick set using a couple of colours from the new Indulgence collection and one colour that is not from the new collection. I'm using these crystals. Um, I normally would use Nail Sugar crystals and I'm a bit naughty doing this, but Nail Sugar haven't got any crystals at the moment. So I've got these crystals and I thought they'd be perfect. I thought I'd use those. And Christmas Wishes, I'm using that one as well even though that's a glitter. So this blue gel polish that I'm using is called Blue Raspberry. I'm gonna use this on the pinky. This is gonna be the base color for us to burnish the Christmas Wishes glitter into. Um, and yeah, so I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do two coats of every single gel polish, but I'm only gonna show you me putting the one coat on. And I've edited out the other, the other coat because I didn't think it was worth me putting um, the other because it's like the same it's just repeating step one then Turkish Delight is going to go on all the other nails I've got some fizzy Fanta it's okay it's zero sugar I've just got this thing for fizzy Fanta at the moment there we go <clears throat> isn't that colour just even this has got a shimmer in it it's got a really fine shimmer through it so none of these are actually like solid colours. These are all, well, I suppose this could be kind of called a solid colour, couldn't it? But they've all got like glitter in, if you know what I mean. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So they cure in the lamp for 30 seconds. The second coat has been applied. I'm now going to burnish Christmas Wishes into the tacky layer of the Blue Raspberry Gel Polish. Um, so I just sprinkle the glitter on using the brush and then I like brush it down and I'll try and get off as much as I can before I top coat. I'm using the non-wipe top coat and I'm just going to go over the top. I do check that there's no glitter 
in my brush before I put my brush back in the bottle. If there is glitter on the brush, I will just wipe it on the paper towel to get that glitter off. Then, we're going to use Nail Camus Crystal Totalist Gem Glue to adhere the crystals. And I'm just going to put this all over the nail in, like, not, I don't want to overdo it. But we're just gonna like we're just gonna cover the whole now and then we're gonna start placing those crystals on they actually looked i thought they'd pick up the blue and the pink more but they actually pick up that you can see a lot of red and that kind of wasn't my intention um so whether they i don't know like when you move the crystals to the side they pick up the that you can see blue in them which is why i wanted to use the christmas wishes um glitter on top of the gel polish and yeah and I thought the Turkish delight would be good because it would pick up the pink though you still get a lot of red as well so I don't know whether they I don't know it might have kind of backfired um, I will let you know when there will be crystals back on the nail sugar website as well um, if you want to get 10% off anything at nail sugar um, use code Natmug10, all in caps. Also, if you do want a brush, I would get one very quickly. I'll show you the nail brush in a minute. Um, but at the minute, I am just going to go over the top of the other three nails with Nail Company's Norm Wipe Top Coat. And then I will cure it in the lamp for 30 seconds. I made a boo-boo there. There we go. So this is, you can leave it like this. I want to just put a little Christmas tree on because I want it to have more of a Christmassy feel, but not like over the top Christmassy. So this is my detailer brush. It's available from Nail Sugar. Um, it's a mate, I love it, but I would, but I do love it. Um, there's not very many left, so if you want one, I would get one as soon as possible. They're 12 95 plus you get 10% off using code NATMUG10. Um, yeah, so there's very little left if you want one. I'm going to use Nail Camis Artisan Gel Paint and my detailer brush to just draw on a tree. I'm leaving little gaps. Um, I'm leaving little gaps so that you could pretend that there's tinsel there. Or it could almost be like a stencil tree. I don't know. But I see this one a lot on, if I search Christmas nails... I see this kind of style of tree like all over Pinterest and stuff so I thought right we'll just we'll just do a tree with like gaps between each I don't know makes it look more I don't know <laughs> I just don't know it is nearly Friday I do I am a little bit bummed up I've got a little bit of a cold again I've not long had one but luckily at the moment, I'm talking and my throat isn't getting too tickly. But this is the first take that I've done of this voiceover. So hopefully, there can't be long left of it, actually. Hopefully, I'll get through it without having to do it all again. Otherwise, if I talk lots, my throat will start to get tickly. <coughs> she says with a tickle in her throat. <laughs> there we go. And then I'm just going to put the... It's like almost like a snow tree. It's not really a Christmas tree. I'm just going to finish that off by put in um, a white section all the way along the bottom not to the bottom of the nail look just like that I'm just gonna and then I'm gonna just fill that in like that and then I'm not gonna cure it before I cure it I am gonna sprinkle it with some clear acrylic this is gonna give it a like a matte textured almost snowy look so we just sprinkle don't cure it before you cure it sprinkle the the uh, acrylic over the um, gel paint there we go tap off the excess I would so the artisan gel paints to cure for 60 seconds I'd leave it in there just for a little bit longer maybe an extra 10 seconds um, and then brush off the loose powder. Then I'm just going to take a little bit more of the Crystal Totalist Gem Glue and place a blob above the tree. And then we're going to put one of the crystals, another crystal, above that. 
and then that will obviously cure for 60 seconds and then I think we're done yeah so this is the I, I'm not sure if I like it I just didn't have time to do another one but I did kind of like it in the end um, let me know your thoughts in the comments did you like it or not <laughs> be nice though <laughs> uh, thank you for watching if you did like this video not necessarily the design if you like the video just leave me a like because I love you <laughs> um, don't forget to subscribe if you want to or just do it even if you don't want to and um, don't forget to check out nail Kami and nail sugar using code napmug10 and I will see you all tomorrow